Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 58 here on planet 26, and we are uh, trying to get this base finished. So I have gotten some ideas down here for the security area. Uh, I think I'm going to expand this out one more cell, uh, and then we're going to put an armory in. Uh, I didn't even think about having that in, so I'm putting an armory in over here, uh, which should uh, kind of wrap around from the uh, third cell over to something about like here. And then I'm going to make uh, kind of a storage area, which only makes sense. You just kind of have a storage area for stuff. Uh, and then uh, this is going to get moved. Uh, my security cameras and stuff are going to go in and then I'm going to have two of them in here. Now with the security cameras, you can't, or at least ways I haven't found anything that would allow it just to flash on the screen from camera to camera to camera. I think that takes too much of a performance hit on uh, Space Engineers. Uh, same problem I had with the uh, LCD panels. And by the way, I went in and fixed those up. And so those are a little bit different now as well. And we'll look at that uh, here uh, at some point. So what I have am going to do though is put cameras in and I'm gonna put control seats like right here. And then you can sit in the control seat and then just choose your buttons as to where you want to look. So the theory will be that uh, somebody will be sitting here, just like if you would at a security room where you have the cameras flashing from screen to screen to screen. Uh, somebody's just going to be sitting in the chair and then you're going to be looking at it that way from camera to camera to camera and you're going to see the rest of the base. Uh, and then uh, I think this area right here is going to be kind of an office area for the security personnel and stuff like that. Uh, and then I'm also going to put in, as part of the armory, some beds and stuff so that uh, the security people have a place to sleep. And then this is where they'll conduct their business and that sort of thing. So the security people will probably be a little more different or... Uh, isolated from the main base population just because they are security uh, doesn't mean they won't interact with them and be able to go in there like I'm not gonna put a shower in over here for them they'll have to go and use the shower over in the living quarters which is fine uh, that's not you know it's no different than like when I go to Alaska there's uh, you don't always have showers where you're at and so you kind of got to go and find a shower you may have all the other amenities but you just don't have a shower and so that's going to be the kind of the case here they're going to have a uh, uh, kind of a, a living area and then they'll still be able to partake in the rest of it but they're still going to be kind of isolated so let me get to work on this uh, i've got quite a bit done i need to get try to get this uh, security area done and i'm going to try to come as close as i can to getting it done today uh, so that uh, the next episode, maybe we'll just kind of wrap this thing all up. So go ahead and uh, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started here.
Well, just to give you a little bit of an update, uh, I know it's been a while. I've been uh, kind of working away here. I do have what I am going to consider the cell holding area done. Uh, as you can see, I've put some LCDs up there uh, so that uh, you can kind of maybe have useful information that can be put in. So just as an example, cell one, Joe Blow, uh, cell two, Fred Flintstone, and cell three, Barney Rubble. Those two are always getting in trouble. And so you have a control seat here uh, that would monitor any of the prisoners that are in there or any of the people that are being held in this, the holding cells. You have a desk for somebody that processed the paperwork. And then these are going to have a couple of posters up here. So I'm going to put posters up there. And I'll get that here in just a little bit. But I think that that's about going to do the, the cell holding area. Uh, you have re reinforced windows here. And then you have the door that's coming in. So you can kind of see in. So if there's trouble, something like that, you can kind of see what's going in. But you mostly have steel blocks put up around here. <laughs> so I think next I'm going to start working on the armory and the uh, kind of the, the little li living quarters for... <coughs> mm, excuse me, let me get a drink of water here. I'm going to put in the get the living quarters and the armory and stuff put in right here so that's what i'm going to work on next and see what uh, i can get that done but uh time's going by fast today uh, but i am uh, making some progress and i kind of like what uh, is becoming of this security area i know that the cell holding area is taking up quite a bit but i do like the way that's come out and i do like the way that the uh, cell blocks are kind of set up there so that you really do have a uh, what looks to be a holding area. All right, let me get started on the armory.
Well, just to give you a little bit of an update, uh, I'm working on the armory where the uh, security people will uh, end up staying. I've got uh, four beds in here, and I'm going to put a kitchen in for them. Uh, some tables, stuff like that. I'll get that all in here. Uh, and I started working on the security, or not security, but the storage area. So this will be maybe some more lockers, uh, armory lockers of some sort, and storage crates. Uh, probably put a bunch of storage crates in here. So that's uh, just wanted to kind of give you a bit of an update. Uh, again, time's passing by pretty fast. So, uh, wanted to give you some narrative of what I've got going on. Uh, I was hoping to get this all done, but uh, I'll keep working away here. But it seems like uh, I'm not going to quite get it all done today. So, let me get back at it. Let me see what else I can get done here. I just uh, got some more parts to uh, go grab, and then I'm going to kind of try to get that storage area all done. I'll get the armory all done. This area right in here was going to be kind of, uh, probably this will be kind of open in here. Maybe a plant or two or something like that. And then this is going to be kind of like a office right in this section in here. Uh, there will be desks and whatnot out here. Uh, this will be for like any of the administrative people that work for the uh, security area. And then this area right here is where I'm going to set up my controls to be able to see the cameras. And that, I probably won't get to that today. So let me get going here. Let me see what I can get done.
Okay, well, I think it's about time to start wrapping up the video. Let me show you what I've got done. Uh, I've got the storage area all done. So we've got containers in here, and we've got a second locker that can just store stuff in there, odds and ends, uh, some more uh, crates. So that's all uh, set here, and that, this can be locked up. Uh, let me go ahead and close this door. So that's the storage area. That's all done. Uh, I'm pretty satisfied with the armory here. We've got lockers in here. Uh, this is where the security guys will grab all of their equipment and whatnot. So there's a armory right here. And we've got an armory over here and then a set of lockers here. Uh, they've got a place to kind of relax a little bit. A table they can sleep in here. A place to do a little bit of cooking and some beverages. So that uh, is the uh, armory. Now these, this is a half block here, so I could put something here, I believe, if I wanted to. I could put an LCD up here uh, if I wanted to. So I'll think about that. But for the most part. I'm going to consider the armory done. Uh, we've got a TV up here, and they happen to have Star Wars playing. And so, uh, looks like uh, this was uh, the original Star Wars movie. Or I shouldn't, uh, yeah, the first Star Wars movie. Episode number four, I believe. Okay, and then we've got the uh, security area all done. Uh, I need to put some uh, stuff on the uh, LCD screens, and I'll get to that at some point. Uh, but we've got uh, lockers in here that are, are not lockers, but we've got holding areas, cell holding areas. Uh, basic for the uh, inmates, or I shouldn't say inmates, uh, for the uh, uh, detainees. Got a sink and a toilet. Uh, a little chair with a desk and then they've got their bed and so that's pretty much all they really need in there uh, so next episode I'm going to work on the cameras I'll need to get the cameras all up this area is going to be set up so that you can uh, view all the different areas here on the base and I'll get that done uh, I've already got an idea of how I want to put that in and then this area here is going to be some desks and whatnot. This will just be more like an administrative area. Uh, let me show you something else that I got done. I'll show you that. I'll also do it in a final recap here. But I did swap out my images that I put in that was take, giving such a performance hit. I uh, So we got uh, Bugs Bunny and... Uh, Daffy Duck on uh, that uh, screen right there now and then uh, we've got a little bit of uh, Lawrence of Arabia right there uh, I got uh, different menus I went ahead and put up uh, you got to get your Clang Cola and your your coffee your uh, cosmic coffee and then we've got a couple of menus put up here so you got your pitas and your burgers I would have liked to have had some other menus but that's that's it uh, I at least got the images up there so that looks pretty good and then if we go upstairs we have what the uh, let me check something out here uh, I thought I had fixed that let's go sci-fi panel and oh it reverted to script it's supposed to be text and images and there we go and that's on all right let's close that now okay there's ripley we've got alien Ripley's not looking so well. She looks a bit worried. I don't blame her with that alien creature. Anyway, 
that's that. We've got that. So uh, the movie theater is all pretty much uh, in place. And so uh, let's uh, go back down below down here. And we'll get back down into the security area. I just wanted to show you that I've we got those LCD panels. That also means I've got uh, images on the TVs in the uh, living quarters area. But we'll look at that at a later time. All right, so uh, I need to get back down here because I was going to have to take a uh, screenshot of one of these areas anyway. Anyway, all right, so we'll wrap it up right here. Well, uh, all you... Uh, Space engineers out there, if you like this video, please hit the thumbs up. It really helps the video out a lot. And please subscribe. That'll really help the channel. Ring that bell. It will let you know when I am uploading new videos, and I am doing that on a regular basis. Okay, space engineers, keep your heads low, keep building away, and don't get shot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.